Welcome to Programming the IBM 1401 Part 2. 8 bits are not a number. In Part 1 we had a look at some memory locations which were displayed here in a light pattern. The 1401 uses 8 bits per memory location, but those aren't 8 bit bytes as we know them today. There are 4 numerical bits, 2 zone bits, a check bit, and a so-called word mark. The check bit and the word mark aren't part of the value. The check bit is only for parity, to detect memory errors, and the word mark is only a control bit for the data processing. So this bit pattern here isn't a 255. The remaining six bits define a character, which can be anything from this list. If you want to store a number, one of the numerical characters has to be used. So with those 8 bits you only can represent a value between 0 and 9. This also explains the term BCD or binary coded decimal, because one character represents one decimal numeric digit. Since a bit pattern cannot be represented by a single number, we simply write down those bits which are set and omit those ones which aren't set. So in this case we write BA8421 or if we want to include the check bit CBA8421. Same here, only numerical bit 2 and zone bit B are set, so we write B2. The arrangement of the bit groups is arbitrary. They may be arranged as on the left hand side, which is the familiar version, or as on the right hand side. It's just a case of convention. They represent the same information, in this case the character M, or you may also say a numerical 4 with the B zone bit set. This again shows that it's useless to assign numerical significance to the bit positions and express it as a number. Instead the identification B4 or CB4 is unambiguous. How the bits are being processed depends on the operation. If we for example use the add command, the numerical parts define the value and the zone bits may define the sign, means whether it's positive or negative, or may show an overflow. A positive sign may be represented by three codings, but the calculated result will use the variant with A and B being set. The check bit will depend on the resulting parity, and the word mark will be explained in one of the next episodes.